Hello guys and welcome back. In this video we are going to be installing this beautiful exhaust system. Yeah, so this is the original silencer, the muffler, um, that came with the bike. It was a little uh, in a sorry state but I've cleaned it up and it's come up just really well. I'm very happy with that and no intentions of changing that at all right now. Uh, looks like it's a straight through pipe as well which I like very much so uh, there should be a good note that comes out of that pipe. And then here we have the header pipes, the exhaust system. It's uh, This one here feeds into here. Um, you may remember from a previous uh, video that um, we had this flange welded on to the top of this pipe because it doesn't come with a flange. And then these were the original exhaust nuts that came with the bike. These are aftermarket that I believe came from Neil Vidin and Rodney Brown. And then I've got the hardware. I went for the more expensive hardware with Coventry. And um, they're beautiful clamps and various piece of, pieces of hardware. Um, gaskets there, copper gaskets. And then the special C-clamp for the exhaust pipe header nuts. So let's get started. Yeah, there's minimal damage to the end here where the flange was welded on. Uh, that's just all that sticky residue cleaned off with some acetate and uh, as you can see those burn marks will be covered quite adequately by the nut. So great, ready to start installing. So before I install the pipes on the bike I'm going to try and coat them on the inside just at the header section here with this internal exhaust coating that uh, used for, for car exhausts and manifolds. Uh, it comes with this 360 degree nozzle um, and my friend Dick has tried this on his exhausts and he had sort of limited success uh, certainly with this with this pipe anyway um, but nevertheless I'm going to try uh, just caught on the inside of this pipe the other pipe uh, just to preserve some of this chrome investment uh, you know just to see if we can sustain the life of the chrome around here although I really don't mind if they go golden or even blue. It shows that you're riding the bike. Don't laugh too much, but I've made this little gizmo. So uh, obviously this is a little pipe and it's going to flap about once it goes inside the exhaust pipe. So made this uh, little contraption. It's just a sponge. And I'm uh, going to shove it in there and held it at both sides so that hopefully as I hit the spray nozzle and pull back, it will give a nice uniform 360 degree spray inside the pipes. Uh, we'll, we'll see, all right. Okay, we'll just take a look, see what the pipe looks like on the inside first of all. There it is. I don't know if you can see that, very clean. Brand new, of course. <laughs> I hope this works. That's probably about there, I would say. It's probably enough. Okay, here goes. Nothing. I might need an extra pair of hands. Yep, I do. Okay, hold it right there. Hold it firm, because I'm gonna... All right, love, here we go. Okay, thank you. Hold on, hold tight to it. Hold it tight.
Oh, is it cold? Yeah. It's freezing. It's so cold. Put it down then, Dom. No, it down. it's fine. <laughs> it's weird. something coming out the other end. I wondered what it was. So. Oh, oh yeah, it's cool, isn't it? Is it full spray paint? I guess it is, actually. It is. Okay, then I'm just going to roll it around and I'll coat it like that. Okay, thanks a lot, love. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll just coat it like that. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did you spill it on you? No, it's on the lawn. <laughs> Don't tell your mum. Well, that's very different to what I expected. I thought actually it would be just a fine jet, but apparently it was quite a nozzle that came out. So subsequently what we've got is we've got quite a lot of the paint inside. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna roll it round and kind of coat it that way as though I'm like coating a gas tank or something. It's not a bad way actually, just thinking about coating it instead of spraying it like this. Well, it worked, not quite as I expected, but it worked nevertheless. I've just given the pipes a clean on the lawn and uh, here they are. You can, hope you can see that. Just sort of a, it's like a coat of paint to be honest on the inside. There are a few parts where it's not quite uh, got it covered, but I think generally speaking, there's a decent film uh, for a good length of the pipe. I'm pretty happy with that, actually. Um, and it worked best by just rolling the paint around rather than trying to use the, um, the spray nozzle, although I think that gave the good coating to begin with. And then on the other side, yeah, not quite as good, but we'll see. I mean, even if it just helps a little bit, I'll try and get that grass out of there. Some of it even went through all the way to the other end, certainly on the other pipe. So great. They're ready to install now.
that needs to move. 